Dumbest thing of the week. New book, American Sniper, Chris Kyle, Navy SEAL Sniper. He's on a program, all right? While on a program, he related a story where he punched out Jesse Ventura. Go. You say you knocked Jesse Ventura to the floor with a punch. Now, you don't mention his name, but everybody knows who that is. Number one, that, that happened? You knocked him out? Yeah. Well, I knocked him down. Knocked him down. I just want to tell you unequivocally, this event did not happen. And I can't speak to anything else that uh, this person would say because I don't know him. To my knowledge, I've never, ever even met him. Okay. So who do you believe? Well, we investigated. Now, there are two eyewitnesses, two SEALs. Andrew Paul said, you could use my name. He, he says that Kyle knocked him down. And another SEAL who's on active duty didn't want his name used. And uh, he said, that, this is true, that, that uh, because uh, Ventura said bad things about the Navy SEALs, that uh, Kyle knocked him down. Now, both of these men are friends of Kyle. But I tend to believe Kyle's telling the truth. I, I, I think uh, he is. Yeah, you know, uh, what I love about this is that uh, you know Ventura is a truther. He always expe ex expects people like us to convince him that 9-11 didn't happen. Now the shoe's on the other foot. He has to convince us that that didn't happen. You say? I say that I tend to believe the Navy SEAL in this story. Look, I do. I, look, if, if Mr. Ventura is anti-war, that is his prerogative. But you can't go popping off at the mouth about it to Iraqi vets. Yeah. And particularly... Well, no, we're, we're not justifying anything that happened. We no. just want to know what happened. And when a guy like Andrew Paul, who's an active Navy SEAL, uh, he's in the reserves, says, look, you can use my name on the factor. I was there. I saw it. Um, and then we got to go with that. All right, dumbest things of the week. Thanks very much. We appreciate it. Been as a big.